I don't know. I don't think you can turn it into a factory. You can turn it into it's a factory. It's really upgraded. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was saying corrected. Hey guys, Johnny and Lawrence back for another episode of Manufacture. Hello. And uh, last episode, we set up our dark matter production, sort of. Well, we sort got of. the anomaly science packs. Which yes. I was hoping there was some in here, but it's clearly still making more. But since then, we made this laboratory last time, but I've set it up just to automate the anomaly science into dark matter, which is just getting stored under here into a dropper, just because it's got nine slots. I didn't really want to store 2048, oh, okay. but I figured yeah. that was like a nice in between. Yeah, that's quite a good also, way of doing it. That's because I'm super clever. Yeah. Also, in between episodes, we did put down our Mark 1 condenser and we just stuck. We've set it up so it's just eating cobblestone and converting into nether stars. We've not got a lot, but it's a starting point. It's actually but I think today eating we stone. Need to... Oh, it's eating stone. Yeah, cobblestone actually doesn't have any EMC. You can't feed oh. it to it. Oh, yeah, yeah, there is. Yeah, Weird. So. I had to hook it oh, up well, to the eating stone, stone after it's been smelted. Yeah. <laughs> but I think today you want to improve our EMC generation a little bit, or at least do some of the EMC generation quests. Yes. Not sure if it's an improvement or not. <laughs> this is quite slow. I mean, it's doing like one a second. It's really slow. It's really, really slow. Yeah. So, to be fair, I, I think this is quite slow as well. Oh, uh, yeah. So I think we should be working on the uh, EMC collectors. So EMC generation. Um, by collecting and focusing the energy from light, you can create items from sunlight. Ooh, magic. The collector can Does be placed next magic. to a condenser and the energy will automatically pass into the condenser. So I think that's the first one we want to unlock. I'm assuming you've been grabbing science. I have kindly unlocked it for you. So you should have access to it now. No. No, I don't. No, no, I unlocked the wrong thing. Do I unlock unlocked the, the mark there too. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, well we're not going to be doing that fine. because it, it's it needs expensive. lots of dark matter. Yeah, yeah, and we don't uh, have a lot. Okay. Let me unlock the real thing. How's that set? Oh, we need anomaly science as well. Yes. Okay. Which we are burning through just now making dark matter. We did have 2048 a second ago. Oh, okay. We just set up that automation. Well, it's do you fine. want to quickly grab some more? Yeah. Because I think to aid us, we're also going to unlock the antimatter relays. Um, so by passing the collected energy through a relay, more collectors can be used. Provides the mark one. So. I should really wait until I hear what you say because I've just unlocked a different quest again. <laughs> oh my god, stop, stop picking quests to unlock at random. Well, it's fine. It's fine. Oh. Um, there, okay, what? Look, look at all the magic quests I'm unlocking. What? Okay, you're just unlocking them all, are you? No, because we're going to run out anomaly in a second. Oh, okay. But I'll unlock as many as we can, I think. Maybe it's worth it. I think that's a good idea. Basically, these are just upgrades to the ones that we've done. To the So yeah. it'll be like the Mark II and then the Mark III. Yeah. I don't and know how the... far we'll be able to get, but uh, we're out of anomaly. Well, we're out of anomaly. Oh, well. Oh, I didn't can... quite get all the way. Well, once that drop of those up with dark matter, this will start to fill up again. So, yeah, we'll probably make I'm our thinking. way through to the Mark II stuff. I think this episode. I think that's achievable. I'm not sure about the Mark okay. III. Well, so, at least they're unlocked in preparation. Yes. So, what I want to do essentially is to make a sort of pyramid out of the antimatter anti relays and the energy collectors that funnel into the condenser that we're using. So, mm -hmm. I, I have done a little bit of testing in the camera and I think I need to make like 13 of the collectors and five of the antimatter relays. So, okay, I that think, sounds doable. Yeah, it should be. I think we should have everything in the system. Let me just grab the rest of these up. So the Mark 1s, they're really quite cheap. It's just some glowstone, a furnace, and a generator, and some capacitors. We don't have any yep. glowstone. 
for I you. I mean, we we do have glowstone. We don't have blocks oh, of just glowstone. Blocks. Oh, just yeah. blocks. Okay, I was gonna say that's concerning. Yeah, that was a little bit surprising. I thought we would have had some of those in the system. Um, but if Funny I... upset, those advanced solar panels from the mob farm are finally coming in useful. Yeah. Um, although we are also out of MV capacitors, so this is going off to a brilliant start. Oh, that's all cheap stuff. It's it fine. is all cheap stuff. Um, I'm a little concerned that we don't have a big supply of batteries. Yeah, not entirely sure why. What? No, me neither. I thought batteries were automated like forever ago. Yeah, they should have been. Oh, they are. Oh, oh, they are. We're just only storing 64 at a time. Oh, okay. Because we weren't using sense. them very often. That's fine. Well, it's Not fine. as concerned now. I've grabbed the 13 energy collectors. So we've got mm -hmm. all of them. They can just take away. Um, now for the antimatter relays, we need some of this power armor plating. I'm not sure how oh, many we've got. Oh, we've got tons of that in the mob farm as well. I think. Oh, the plating. No. Ah. Doesn't sound good. No, we I don't have, know like, if you four. can... Um, I wonder if you can use the power armor, like get it back. No, I was hoping you can maybe like crush it or something to get the plating. Yeah, no, but it, it looks look like, like you it. actually need to make it. So I think that's what we're gonna have to do. Um, we're gonna yeah, need to grab this that is fabricator. Boring um, stuff that we've done before. Should we just quickly make a bunch? Yeah, I think we'll make a bunch and then we'll come back. So I think we've now got enough advanced plating, but it did take a lot of carbon plates. So to make it faster, I just spammed metal presses. But these things are horribly loud. So Lawrence Incredibly made me a loud. present. Incredibly, Incredibly loud. loud. But he made this sound muffler bobble. And what this does is you can mute sounds completely. So if you click on the ad and then recent, it will show you all the things that you've recently heard. And I feel like we'll add that to my thing and instantly silence oh it's so nice you can just chuck that in your bobo slot and now they'll work away but make no noise perfect but you got the the stuff now to make us some relays i um yeah i'm just sorry i'm just trying to add my stuff to my bobo as well and i'm struggling everything is so loud but it it's is quiet very now. loud um, I suppose so, I should put the crusher on there, maybe, as well. The crusher was incredibly loud when I did it. But, so we've got the power armor plating, at least enough to do the Mark 1, I think. So if I grab five of these... Woo, that was nice and easy. It's far too easy. Never <laughs> um, so say we, far too easy. <laughs> uh, there, no, that sounds like a challenge. Please don't change anything. We could probably upgrade the antimatter straight to Mark II because they only need dark matter, and I think we should have went from that dropper. Oh, right. so I... yeah, it's it's on applied energetics, so you should be able to access it. We might have needed some more of that plating, but I'm sure there's oh, loads okay. in the machine over here, right? There's another ten. Uh, yeah, that would do. I can't grab that out. There you go. Oh, it's because you're not very good. Well, whilst that takes away, I think do we? I think this needs to be set up outside. I think it needs uh, sunlight to work. Kind All of right. implied by the quest book. Oh, um, I did not realize that. I think that's but, maybe different in this pack. This is, uh, you can focus the energy from light. You can create items from sunlight. Oh yeah, it's uh, kind of implied. Although, if I put one of these down, well, it seems to be working. Whereas the sun at like know. half. Well, if you click uh, it, yeah. you can yep. see like the 16. What happens is that, if... Is that the time of day? Maybe. The sun is like slap bang in the middle of the sky. So I'm surprised oh. that it says half sun, if that's even what that is. What about if I chuck a block of... Glowstone on top. Oh. Does that make a difference? Oh, well, that, that's... Yeah, the sun is now full oh, yeah. there. Hmm. Oh, so it doesn't need to be outside. But it also doesn't make pollution, I wouldn't expect. So if you want to put it outside, feel free to put it outside. Mm -hmm. Oh, I now have the power of the sun. Where would you like them? I don't know. I was thinking... I'm not on sure what I was roof. thinking. <laughs> we could do it on the roof if you really fancied. I was maybe thinking in the center bit here. But I'm also aware we probably want them somewhere near a crafting terminal. 
Um, I really don't mind. Wherever you feel like. We can put them upstairs in this factory, actually, because they won't make pollution. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's put them upstairs, yeah. We so. could put them... I don't know. <laughs> well, let, me, let me grab the chest. Because I'm going to be moving this. Um, oh, you can put glowstone inside the machine as well. Oh, okay. And then like, there's it... a progress bar. I don't know what it's doing. That is I'm very, waiting to see when it gets slow. to the top. It is pretty slow, but I have no idea what it's doing. I feel like it's going to use it all, whatever it does. Oh, it turns it into redstone. Oh. That's I interesting. Guess that's and it used EMC. Oh, I think it was slow because it was using EMC to convert into redstone. Oh, okay. That's quite that's weird. So, I don't really uh, get the point. You don't really get the point. So, how no. these sort of work is you can either chuck the. I keep getting confused by the glowstone and the energy collector because they look very much the same. Um. So Look if you at all pop, my redstone blocks. <laughs> that is, I don't see where they are. How do you not? You don't see them. Oh no, now I see them. It just took a second. So you can either, so the way these sort of work essentially, you can either put the energy collector next to the condent condenser, and that mm -hmm. will essentially push all of the EMC that it generates into the chest, I think. Mm -hmm. I say okay. that because this number is going up and this is not. But that might be because I I think you need an item in there, yeah. Yes. So if I pop there, a never sleep, there you go. Now it's working. But if you want... So in theory, you could chuck five of these around it. Because you obviously Ooh. need to, a phase to get into it. But if you want to yep. do more, you can cheat a little bit. You can essentially pop a antimatter relay next to these chests. And what okay. they will do is they will collect the energy from these uh, energy collectors and push so it into to the be chest adjacent. for you. Yes. Can so, you chain relays? I don't know if you can. To be honest, I oh, didn't curious. try that because I didn't think of that. So stop making <laughs> me look stupid. But thank you. Um, no, so fine. I think what we should do is we should... Because I don't want to use the Mark 1 collectors, I think we should upgrade straight to the Mark 2. Do you think we can manage that? Oh yeah, they, mm, we've got an unfamiliar item in there. We do have we an unfamiliar item. Z004. Do you and know I did what spend Z is? a lot of research. I have you no idea it. what Z is. So Z004 is the Osmium Compressor. Luckily we just um, need like 50 of each. So if I... Oh, and there's... There's none of the tricky science. There's it was only the really anomaly that I ran out of. Yeah. Everything so else is fine. I think if we go and unlock that, we can look and see what that does. Yeah. So, I mean, it's probably just like your typical mechanism machine. There you go. Yeah. All unlocked. So, the osmium compressor fuses materials with osmium, producing specialized mechanism alloys. Mm. Which sounds very, very, very fancy. It does sound fancy. Um, are like you in the process middle. of? I have not. I was just gonna make one now. Uh, oh, me. Um, oh, I can um, do it if you want. It was just I was getting the tier things first. Ooh, oh, we don't have all the stuff. We don't have all the stuff, do we not? No, we oh, need these. enriched alloys, which apparently I guess we haven't automated. I could have sworn that we had all those. I thought we would have automated them by now, but maybe not. Let me pop uh, over to Misk and have a look. Because we definitely have the machines to make them. Oh, yeah. you're already over here. I am already over here. Like, We're slow. It's not that oh, We don't slow. have any upgrades in there. No, Ugh. We yeah, we, we only actually... need four at least. Yeah. That should be enough. Um, and luckily yeah, there only, a... I think I left all the stuff in the crafting terminal, so I'll need to go back to the house. Yeah. But it's fine. Oh, oh no, I didn't. Oh, I could have did it there. That's annoying. Did you, did you pick up the alloys? Oh, I it. They came out of the machine. Did you pick them up at the exact same time? No, but oh, they right. weren't in the system, and now they are, and I don't know why. I'm very confused. Oh, okay, well, no, they're not in the system for me. 
Oh, okay, well, I just I have system? I have just used them. I have made them. I've made the machine. Oh. Okay. Fine. Yep. It's okay. I did it for us. So mm -hmm. I think we should pop that one there. Um. Now, from memory, this is quite simple. I'm clicking the show yep. recipes, and it's not doing anything. That's kind of awkward. Ah, uh, it's maybe because you need to upgrade it to the smell like proper full tier factory. I'm sure that was the problem. I don't know. I don't think you can turn it into a factory. You can turn it into it's a factory. It's really upgraded. I, yeah. <laughs> I, I was saying corrected. I could have sworn in my head this is one of those that you can uh, upgrade. But I think oh, we might right. just need a quick relog because I'm looking at the recipe for the guys donating goods and it's not updated. Yeah, there we go. There it's quite simple. Go. Just osmium ingot and some glowstone dust. Yeah. Luckily, we have some osmium ingots here. But do you have glowstone dust? I do not. Because I do. Here we go. Um, Sort. That burns through. This is like when we use the flint rather than the liquid. It like tears through the material. I guess you'd really want to use the liquid osmium rather than the osmium ingots. Maybe. Actually, would you get oh, more? I, I don't even know. If I don't even know. Get liquid osmium. Maybe you can. Maybe I'm just making stuff up. No, yeah, I can't no. see your Okay, I think you just have to stick in yeah. ingots like that. Oh, well, oh, there we go. There's some glowstone ingots for you. Yay. Um, chuck them in the system. The other thing we're going to need, because it's not just one thing that's new, there's two things that new that's new. We're gonna need this solar oh, yeah. neutron activator. Um, this is used in fusion if we get into that side of things, if we need more energy, but for the time being we don't, so I'll just craft it. Um, and I'm actually gonna yep. need some more alloys. Yep, I, I figured, so that's why I'm filling up the redstone one with iron. Ah. Uh, we really should have automated these at some point. Well, I mean, they're like okay. so close to being automated. We automated all the like filling of the, the like, what are they called? The uh, compressed redstone and things. We oh, yeah. never actually automated the, the final bit. Here's seven. How's that, that going to do? do? Um, I don't know how many you're making. I was just going to make one on camera and then we can do the rest off camera. So, oh, okay. <laughs> there is a solar neutron activator and that goes straight back in the system. So that's how we do things these days. So, like if we've done the glowstone Mixed. anger, got some dark matter, just bang it all together, and there's our Mark II. So I think we Easy. should go away and upgrade those, and now we can fully set up the... Wait, should we put them down side by side first just to see the Ooh, difference? That is a good idea. Because um, I'm intrigued how much faster it is. Well, there's the Mark II. There's the Mark II. Yeah. Well... I mean, I feel like to properly test this, we really need to get the glowstone on top as well. Oh yeah, that would work. So oh, that's a big difference. Yeah. Yeah. And we can actually upgrade these again. We just need to find glowstone crazy blocks. Expensive. And red matter, oh. which is very oh, expensive. Yeah, I was going to say, that sounds really easy, but yeah. yeah. The, the, red, the matter. red matter block is going to be the problem. I think red matter might be something for next next episode because I think we also need those to upgrade the condenser as well. Yeah, there's a whole rabbit hole of like alchemical coal. To be honest, we probably just need to find a good way of generating a mass amount of EMC. So if anyone's got any good suggestions for EMC farms, like drop them in the comments below. Yeah. But yeah, let's go set up a few of these and get your pyramid thing going. Okay. So a little bit of crafting later, and I think we've got everything. Um, so we've got Mark II antimatter relays and Mark II energy collectors. Um, yeah. I didn't realize this actually tells you how much they generate in the tooltip, which is quite clever. Um, oh, yeah, I never noticed that either. Yeah, no. So uh, like the Mark One will do four EMC, the next one will do twelve, which is like three times. Look at me doing that. Pardon? The next one's 40. What is that times? Uh, 10. <laughs> 10. That shouldn't have taken me so long. Um, no, it's three and a bit. Oh, right. Oh, for the Mark 1. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to place five of these uh, antimatter relays around. Now, these should hopefully all funnel EMC 
from these guys, from the collectors. Well, I shall open the chest so we can see. And yes, that is it is doing chest. a thing. It's doing a thing. Now, if I, because you can do them on every, I don't think you can do them on every face. I don't think you can put them underneath the relays because then you're blocking like the circle. I think if we put them like so, it's like a pyramid. I don't know if you I just cover. Try putting them underneath and seeing what happens. <laughs> I don't have any more. I have the, the exact right oh, okay. amount. So, but that is now our dirt. I would say it's a pyramid more than a flower. Yes. Or Maybe like one or two hundred a second ish. But that that's not bad. That's quite good for no, what we that had seems before. Seems reasonable. What is? Um, I'm gonna look at the. Cobbles. Oh yeah, you moved the yeah, one from the cobblestone. Yeah, we moved but that would be it's not me feeding how many it makes, which I think is mm. like one a second. So we were getting like one EMC a second. It wasn't very fast. I'm confused. Do these things make pollution? Because we have carbon up here, which I don't I think they thought. Do. I think I, I would have thought we could miss any here. Yeah, but it would hit a vent. They're like all speed. I don't know. Weird. I don't know. It doesn't. Anyway, weird, but yeah, this is our things of our EMC generation. Yeah. So th this is just gonna be like nice passive EMC generation. Yeah, but I do you think have we to do probably it, like... want to make some crazy EMC generation system at some point. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. We would we would love your feedback for that because I do not know the best source of EMC in this no. pack. Normally, I go through like crops, so we like because I think everything we've played is like, like mystical crops, so we just like yeah. farm emeralds into it, but not but it's, like, I no doubt magic. There crops. is an easy way to get emeralds in this. No, um, no. they do have a lot of EMC for, yeah. but uh, no, I'm not seeing a cheeky, cheesy way anyway. Legendary loot bags. I mean, we could make our mob farm crazy, crazy, crazy. And <laughs> Maybe. Also, I, I just realized I'm literally carrying around two stacks of nether stars. Don't know why. Okay, just, well, that would also help with the MC. Well, we're uh, making nether stars. I can't put them in the chest. No, I don't. No, that's fine. Just check them in the system. Then we got it. <laughs> well, we've got like, I don't know, a six of a nether star in that time. That doesn't seem yeah, unreasonable. So terrible. And again, we will be upgrading that to three times again, hopefully. So we're kind of hoping, yeah, if we leave that for a bit, it should hopefully make enough EMC that we can create the dark matter in our Eternalis? Eternalis uh, fuel? Whatever it is. Eternalis? And the Mobius fuel and the alchemical coal and all this stuff. But I think that's probably going to have to be stuff for next episode. But I think that's yeah. not too shabby. Some nice EMC generation on the go. It's a stop. Yeah, but I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Be sure to leave a like if you did. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.